Hello. What's up, guys? We are on our way on our trip, Hello. and we stopped by at Jack in the Box. Thank you. Thank you. This is my Uber driver. Just kidding. Hi. And we have a guest in the back. Let's go. We're at the airport on our way to Tokyo. I'm with my dad and my mom. <laughs> All right, we're in the plane, and I think it's moving. We are taking... This is the drink menu and what they serve for free. And I got excited because I had plenty of leg room. Yay! In front of you, you get a monitor. And the cute thing is they wave to you as the plane leaves. Bye, San Diego! About an hour and they serve snacks. I asked for orange juice and this was just um, just a mix of crackers and pretzels and whatnot. If you want your window dim, you would have to press the buttons that is below the window. They did not have a window shade. And each circle you see there is a different setting for how dark you want your window. Are we there yet? After two hours in in your flight, they serve you with your meal. You get the option to choose one between two. I chose the chicken with the rice. And with this meal, you get salad, fruit, uh, soba noodles, Italian ham, mushrooms, and marinara sauce. And your main meal that you choose. They also give you miso soup, which was really good. I also needed wine because I needed to sleep. And I got excited because they actually give you silverware. Silverware is not just for first class. And you had to pour the sauce over the noodles, which was a sesame oil-based type sauce. And for the dessert, they give you ice cream. Two hours before you land, they serve you your last meal, which was fried rice that came with Greek yogurt, bread, and fruit. And if you wanted, they will also serve you miso soup. It was delicious. I enjoyed the rice. We're about to land. It's probably it's about 10.30 in um, San Diego p.m. and we left at 11.45 a.m. So that's the time difference. I see land. We finally landed after 11 hours. We landed around 4.45 in Japan, which was on the next day, Monday, since they are a few hours ahead from us. It took a while to get to our gate, so it, it was a long ride from landing all the way up to our gate. I was surprised to see Delta Airlines and FedEx at Japan. There's my parents in front of me. Let's go see where we're going. Hawaiian Airlines in Japan. So, what did you think of the food? What did you have? The chicken? Too much, yes. I had the chicken. I think their customer service is excellent. That, huh? Their customer service is excellent. Suck? No, it's excellent. Oh, yeah, it is. And the, they're clean. And the space is so The space was no perfect. Yeah. Request for extension. And. Yeah. Then driving to LA for lunch. It's totally lunch. worth it. You liked yes. it? Did you like the food? Yeah, too much. I didn't care for the, the, I don't know, the chicken was kind of, tasted like teriyaki, but the rice was good. Oh. I'm sleepy. A very thin teriyaki. Yeah, like the thin. flavor is very light. Um, I didn't like the m mushrooms because it had no flavor. Marinata sauce. You have to dip it in the marinara sauce. <laughs> the noodles were good, the soba noodles. Yeah. It had like a sesame soy sauce type uh -huh. of sauce. And yeah, that's and it. Seafood. It's hot. I'm sweating. What? I don't know. Here comes the father. I was starving when we landed, but I only realized this an hour before takeoff to our connecting flight. Uh, they had a Yoshinoya at the airport, which had a long line. I'm not a fan of Yoshinoya in the States, but it looked delicious in Japan. The plane from Narita to Manila is smaller. I barely had any leg room. Maybe it's because the older lady who sat next to me took up most of the space with her shopping bags. 
The food was terrible. I had yellow chicken curry by Chef Mashi Motuka. It was not delicious. They did not give you a choice. That was what they served you. And it came with a side of salad and a tuna and cheese salad, steamed chicken mimosa style, and a pounded burdock root. They also served miso soup and ice cream. Lawag is about an hour north from Manila, so I knew we were almost there and we made it safely. Stay tuned for my next Ivy's Kitchen Adventure Vlogs. I hope you enjoyed watching this and I will see you guys on the next video. Bye! Thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon so you are notified each time I post a new video.